Hey guys, what's happening? Doug Rappaport here. Welcome to my studio. I'm pleased to announce that I'm going to be working with Incognito Guitars, a new online music store that offers the best gear available anywhere. They're going to be sending me guitars, amps, pedals, all kinds of neat goodies. I'm going to demo them for you, and you're going to buy them. Well, first up on the docket today, we've got a guitar coming to us from ESP Custom Shop in Japan. This is the ESP KH3. KH are the initials of a fairly well-known guitar player named Kirk Hammett. Yeah, Kirk Hammett. Okay, well, he's a guitarist for a band called Metallica. They are a famous heavy metal band. Kirk Hammett went to ESP 30 years ago to uh, set out on a tour for the Black Album. And he had a design idea while everyone else was sort of running around with pointy guitars. Very dangerous. Uh, he wanted something that looked like the old Gibson Melody Makers. And this is what they designed for him. And he toured with it for years. Um, this guitar was re-released in 2021, this style of guitar after, I guess, being shelved for a while. And it's got some cool stuff on it. It does have 24 frets. It's got a Floyd Rose, as you can see, and a really cool neck on it. It feels kind of narrow, but it's really easy to play chords. You know, sometimes when I see a, a narrow neck like that, I get nervous because I'm kind of a ham-fisted guitar player, but I really have no problem playing chords on this thing. It's really easy, really easy to play neck. And check it out here, you got these sort of, uh, at first glance, looks like a Strat layout for these knobs. But it's more like a flying V, and if you're familiar with those uh, 58 flying Vs, you had a volume knob up here for the neck position, and then the next one here was a volume knob for the bridge, and then a master tone. Three-way toggle. Yeah, Floyd Rose, locking. It's all black, as you can see. And... Uh, Bone Breaker EMG pickups. They are Kirk's signature pickups, and you can tell they're his signature pickups because they got a signature on it. Let me check that out. Yeah. It says, I don't know what it says. It's illegible, but it's his signature. And that's how you can tell it's his signature pickup. It's got a signature on it. I think one of the most notable things about this is the, is the cool design. Apparently there's a guy who handles the graphics for Metallica. His name is Pusshead? Pusshead? Anyway, he designed this. It's a spider sitting in a web. It's got a skull. Skull's got fangs. It's really cool. Check that out. What do you think? I think that's really cool. And it looks great against the black paint. And a cool testament to the craftsmanship over at ESP Japan, the inlays are the same spider you see here. Um, really beautifully done. Skull and crossbones, though, going back down that way. Really cool. Really cool. Kirk Hammett name on the headstock. If you're in a Metallica tribute band, or even if you're just a huge Kirk Hammett fan, this is the guitar, man. It's great. Let's give this thing a listen, shall we? Let's start with the neck pickup. I'll start in a lower volume. Get kind of clean. Nice clarity. a little more.
all the way up. Yeah, cool. Let's go to that uh, bridge pickup right here. Here we go. Start with a lower volume, kind of clean. That's cool. You know, I'm going to turn the volume down and get a cleaner tone again and mix the two together. We'll put that pickup selector in the middle position and just see if we can get some different sounds. Yeah. That's the two pickups together. This thing is cool. So I think now I'm going to play some tracks. I'm going to make a little song. I'm going to jam a little bit for you. And uh, hopefully I won't like totally scratch and destroy this guitar because I get really into it. I won't. I'll be careful. I promise. Because it ain't my guitar. It's your guitar. All right, let's do this. Here we go. <laughs> 